Oh my god, it's video time for the next part of my Let's Play series. Yeah, I know you're thinking, holy crap, back to back, yes. Let's go. We're going to the pub to meet Walter. Da -da -da. Um, last episode, I finished off the reliquary, got the magical boxing of Wajimajigi artifact that only heroes can get. And now... Oh god, stupid guy. Move on away. Uh, we're off to see Daddy, Walter. Oh, You're going to well, you were successful then. Bloody marvellous. You'll be glad to know I have some information on the mercenaries Sabine mentioned. They're led by a man called Saker. He used to be a soldier, but always had more in common with bandits and cutthroats than the military. His men are holed up in a small fortress in the mountains, so it won't be easy to get in. But I have a plan. Come with me. His plan involves making you look like a twat. One of the mercenaries, a cold-blooded killer. His name's Clarence, but everybody calls him Jimmy. He was drinking in the pub all day and generally making life unpleasant for everyone. It wasn't hard to get him completely pickled, these young thugs. Bloody lightweight, if you ask me. Anyway, take his clothes and you'll have a free pass into their camp. Just try not to think about what those stains might be. Uh, what? Really? Okay. You sure you don't have a better plan? <laughs> hmm. You're not likely to convince anyone without a bit of extra effort. Even these idiots will notice if you don't have his beard or tattoos. I'm sure you can get hold of what you need around town, though. In the meantime, I'll find out who to talk to about getting food to the dwellers. They might not have much to spare here, but they're kind people. They'll just need a little convincing. Anyway, good luck dealing with Saker and his mercenaries. It'll be your first taste of real battle. But I know you'll do just fine. Hmm. You appear to have earned enough gold to purchase the rather repulsive items you require to complete your mercenary disguise. A most impressive feat for a member of the royal family. Of course, should you have acquired a taste for labor, you may continue working for as long as you wish. Remember, at the end of the last video, I told you to get over a thousand gold so we could pro progress now. I thought you might as well get it over and done with since you come out where, right where the jobs are. I could get used to this. And it's just a lot faster. So go into this store where you can buy hair stuff and wow, he's so what gay. Are you looking for? Not that I have anything <laughs> against top gays. For top quality item. But wow, said you can actually get sword, more gay than that. Oh dear. Um. Yeah, tattoos, 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 tattoos. Are all dungeons dark and dead? What's he doing? Give your nose a friend. Oh Get right, yeah. Shit, sorry. Let's see what we can do for you. Being retarded. Yeah, maybe you might have a look in the sanctuary shop. I'm quite certain there is something new in there. Uh, ignore him whenever he says that the sanctuary shop is just downloading the, the required ingredients downloadable for your content. Distasteful mercenary disguise. You may return to the sanctuary to change into it when you wish. Stay in business if they weren't. All right. <coughs> so just gonna get to the bridge first. Now let's put on them awesome let's clothing. Let's the room and see about your disguise, shall we? There are short cookies to get into the rooms, but they're the not open yet. The appropriate facial hair adorns the bust before you. A facial. Thank you very Perfect. much. You look dangerous and devoid of all human decency already. Press the now, equals button the to go to the to to yeah to your tattoos section. Equip all the tattoos. The beard and the tattoo are splendid. You're just missing one thing. The mercenary outfit. Uh, so is it? Get yeah, equals twice, and then you can just equip all the mercenary outfit. Now you look like ah, you're completing yes, a retard. Mercenary indeed. You'll fit right in with those brutes. Now then, you better be off to deal with Saker, haven't you? So let's get a moving. Oh, slip. Just wondered how would you like me to go about playing through this game? Would you prefer me to only use one type of combat style, use all three, or hmm, let me think, is there any other way I could do it? <laughs> I 
don't think you can have no item. I mean, I could try. That'd be funny to see me punch everything to death. And more wolves. Charge up. If you have a slow ranged weapon, it has a lot more range on it. So you can get out of range of them before they even see you and take them out like a ninja. My doggy did well. I can't even see the glowing trail because it's so bright. It's the only problem when you flourish or charge up a ma magic spell, it makes the gamma and contrast just really weird. But it still does look kind of cool, just makes it hard to play the game. Killing some dwellers. Come on in. He's even more ugly than me. And that's saying something with this get up. Sometimes wish I'd join me dad with a family business. I did, yeah. Well, I never saw myself as a sugar salesman. And it wasn't really feasible after I killed him, no? Oh, Jim. Don't be shy, Jimmy. Come on over. Just ignore them. Hey, Jimmy, over here. Remember, you are Ninja Ninja stealth with your Ninja Ninja costume. I like that clown suit. You've been drinking in Brightwall again? But don't let anybody tell ya, drinking alone is wrong. That's some of the best times I've had. Anyway, in you go then, mate. Right. Right here, hey, you'll what get you caught. Not really you. You look different somehow. That's gonna Your be eyes fun. always that color. Nah, Jimmy's got periwinkle eyes like a beautiful summer morning sky. Not him. It's not Jimmy. Oh my god, as if that was a bad plan anyway. Come on, it's him back. <laughs> Most of the scenery and setting can be used in combat. But if you saw me there, I pushed him against the wall and then he got stabbed. <laughs> you went flying, mate. Come all over here that you can um, shoot and they blow up. But before we go any further, there's a nice chest over here for us to collect. You got the thing! Mercenary left arm tattoo. Easiest thing to do for the, this bit is just you should rifle or pistol. So make sure you get all the chests, I'll be showing you where they all are. Another, that's the chest hole. Oh, Jesus. And you don't. You can actually aim if you hold down the mouse button that you use to do surround spells after you Shot, so it zooms in. Headshot. And they're all dead. Let's go. So if you have trouble with the auto aim system, you can use it to aim at the I mean the manual aim system to hit the explosive barrels, but for some reason it doesn't let you shoot that one because the wood is in the way. And what was he say dig spot? I'm guessing it's not like here. Or not this side. Bad guess on my part, just bad memory. Kill it. 
Jimmy impersonator! Yes, something. No, it's not. Oh, where's the other guy that is? You're doomed, mate! <laughs> Them. So if you're standing next to a barrel and you shoot, it should not auto-target and blow yourself up. Which is a really nice feature, it actually detect detects when there's enemies in the vicinity. Oh, another dig spot can't be asked. Uh, those three potions will be needed. You will need when you go through here, there'll be an your first boss fight. Oh my god. Leave him! He's mine! You've left quite a trail of bodies. You're not one of Sabine's dwellers, that's for damn sure. But you'll die like one. I'm gonna rip you a new one. You, you. Uh, if you use range, he will also use range. If you use melee, you'll get screwed over. Because he'll... Oh, I'll just show you. Uh, pushes you back. And he also does that, which you can't defend against. So, my recommendation is to just range. And then when he goes to throw something at you, just use space to dodge. So, Now it gets a little bit trickier, so... Ah! Potion, you can use it and then just shoot the crap out of this guy. There we go. Stop! You've won. This battle is yours. Kill me or let me live. It's your choice. You're gonna die. die. Feel the pain. The mercenaries. But we have our codes, like any other soldiers. We'll leave the dwellers be, no matter what you do. That is a warrior's promise. How do you like me now? Don't worry if you did miss anything through the bandit camp, you can actually go back and get it using the fast travel system because you can now fast travel to Brightmoor, Bandit Camp and the Dweller Camp. 